makes me day, it makes me proud to be here, to be one of the first senior citizens to get this vaccine. I'm doing it for me, I'm doing it for my loved ones that I can interact more with my family and especially my grandchildren. One of our religious leaders said to me as I walked in, he said to me, you know, today feels like an amazing day. It feels to me like that day in 1994 when we were able to cast our vote for the first time. And I thought about it after he said it. I thought, wow. And that is actually the kind of day. And the IEC office enabling us to do that are our amazing frontline nurses that are in our voting stations and they are busy making sure that we're getting our jabs. The people that we know is the most vulnerable is the people over 60. Therefore, this day for me is emotional because we know we will still lose some people over 60 in the coming two or three months, but much less than what we would have lost if we didn't start the vaccination. So this is not about the technicalities of providing a, vac a vaccine. All the logistics that happen behind the scenes. It's about the dignity that we're restoring for somebody that's at risk.